Okay, so in this video we're going to create our ad account. If you have one already, you don't need to do this step, but if you don't, then you're going to need to. So you go to business settings again, and that'll bring you up to all your assets in your business account, and you just go to ad accounts. See, I got a couple in there already, so I'm just going to click on add, and here it's going to be create a new ad account. I'll just create one for the business. So I'm going to call it um, this. So we'll do engraving profit so I'll just call it that it's gonna go in there make sure your time zones right and make sure your currency is right otherwise um, you can't change the time zone or currency once you start this so I'm going to put it in Canadian because I have a Canadian visa that I'm going to attach to it so you create the ad account if you're in the US um, then you can oops abuse and fraud oh crap reach the maximum number of ad accounts associated with this business manager Okay, that is how you do it. I'm just going to change the name of one of these. Let's go to... What's this one? Valentine's Day. So, what I'll do is I'll, I'll just rename this, since it's already one. Let's call it... Uh, you have to go and click Add Account and you'll be able to. Apparently I'm only allowed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I guess I could email them and get another one but I'll just change the name to Engraving Profits. Like so. There we go. And I'll have a pixel for that too. So if I want to go to the ad account, I just click it. Now I'm into the Ads Manager. You can see I had a couple little campaigns in there from before. Um, so I'll just kind of delete those and I'll run only this one on it. Because I didn't really use that ad account anyway, so that is how you do it. Now you've got your ad account set up. It might ask you to enter the billing information and that's where it'll prompt you and you just have to go through the steps and enter your credit card or attach your uh, PayPal account. So if you do run into that maximum number of ad account thing, just email their support and just say that you need more. Um, this is my second business manager account so I guess they're limiting me to a certain amount. My other ad account or my other business manager has like a lot more flexibility because a lot more money has been run through it. But I had to create a second one just for to have the ability to do demonstrations without revealing all my ad accounts and all my pages and everything else to everybody. Hope that makes sense. Okay, so go ahead and create your ad account. Make sure you set your time zone and your currency to the one you want. And then we're on to the next step.